Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to some more Seven Days to Die. Uh, I tried to see if I could optimize my settings a little bit better, so... Yeah. See if we can run a little bit of a higher frame rate, but should be good. A little bit better now. Uh, let me clean up my inventory. Get some stuff put away. Let's scrap that. Put some leather in there. Recar. can you sell? I guess I'll carry this blunderbuss ammo. It's kind of important, I guess. Don't need the that ammo right now. Some wood, paper, iron, cloth, clay, cement. I got a, a lot of good stuff. Mm, I think this episode. Oh, I need to eat. Let's go, let's go collect a bunch of wood. I want to start at least the base layer of that little, oh shoot, I almost jumped off the edge. Oh, come on. you work with me oh this is bad okay, at least I knocked him down and then I killed him okay hold on I need to fix something here hold on the screen might go black for a split second and let me try playing in windows mode See if that'll help. Okay. Yeah. Works a lot better. Uh, I don't like you. Not that. Uh, so these bones, no recog. Let the door oh, and get you on your way out. Okay. So I'm going to come back here. Yeah, I think I'm going to make... I'm going to make this a little bit more level. Or at least bring this down so zombies can't just walk up this way. There's a lot of mining in this episode. Let me see if I can make this up, bring it up a little bit. Yeah, the only person that should be able to get up this way is me. And that's only if I have Parkour. Uh, parkour, I think it's three, so I can jump up two blocks high and or have some of my little wooden stuff right now. These little wooden frames. Because I don't want zombies just walking up over here. I can make my HUD a little bit smaller because I can't really see my HUD. Uh, UI. Is there a way to move it up? UI style. Oh, it didn't help. 
I'll just put it back down. Sorry about this. I love the march. There you go. Now I can see my stuff. They better not have spawned down there. I swear. Is that not going down? I think it's just glitching. I went ahead and adjusted the audio a little bit better so maybe you don't hear because my computer does run a little hot so I have fans running in the background. So I adjusted my microphone just a little bit so hopefully you don't hear as much of the fan whenever I'm not speaking. done with this section. Yeah, so after I mine, mine up all this right here, good amount of crushed sand, good amount of stone. Um, excuse me. Hopefully um, I can get I'll have some points in this XP we get from mining and I'll be able to make it or put it in a not miner 69er but the other one I forgot what it's called so I can get more resources from stuff I mine so hopefully get a lot more wood oh, dang, it would break right there okay yeah zombies should no longer be able to jump up should be safe here uh, yeah. Okay, now we need a bunch of trees so we can start making our wall up there. Oh shoot, I was gonna check uh, skill points. Okay, I got one skill point. I already have a yeah, lucky berry. Mother load. Yeah. Uh, for a small vein. I was 20% more ore from stone to rain blocks and trees with an axe. Oh, I don't have an axe. Or, yeah, this counts as an axe. Uh, I'll, I'll hold off on that one. I think, though, that we can. Pain tolerance one. I already have that. Can we, can we start putting some in cardio? That's stamina regen, I believe. sounds fast. Oh, never mind. I haven't showed you guys the club yet. Yeah. It's just like, it does the same stuff the sledge can do. Just you're able to swing a little bit faster with less stamina. The sledge can put him down in two hits. This one take about three or four. You have to watch out for those trees too, because if you do, if you're able to run in front of it, it will kill you if it lands on your head. That's one thing you gotta be very... Oh, there's a mini horde. Yeah, when you see when you see a gaggle of zombies like this, yeah, it's a it's a mini horde. But they occasionally pass through. I didn't think there could be mini hordes on base. Like... Now we should get a good amount of XP from clearing up this horde. Ooh, forged steel? I thought that was iron at first, but that, if that's forged steel... Oh, we're looking pretty good right now, I can tell you that. 
I don't think I shot my gun last episode, so. Look at the zombie blast in action. That guy's are right. Oh, he's dead now. Got ourselves a good amount of XP from that. Let's go ahead and clear out some more of these trees. Reverse move. <laughs> uh, let me see. to the party buddy it's probably coming over because he heard the gunshot let's get some more wood I need a lot of it I would actually no I wouldn't actually. <laughs> I was gonna say I would I would uh try to build into cement because there's a mixer in the traders, but I don't think you're able to use it. I think you can just search it. You're not able to use it though. Yeah. I don't wanna go spec into cement real easy. Like maybe if we were trying to aim for like day Day, f uh, day 70 or something, I'd, yeah, definitely. I'd be all over cement. I think this episode's gonna be a lot of mining. Next episode, I'll probably get stuff done. Ooh, lag. Yeah, so sorry if the lag really bothers you. It bothers me a lot too, so. Two skill points. Level up twice. Um, so I kind of want to get more lucky looter going on right now. Uh -huh. yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Lucky looter level two is at perception two. Pot luck. There's no bears on the horizon. Get some metal ore, I think. This should give us metal ore. <laughs> it doesn't. That's a lot of rock. Yeah, I don't think it does. It's almost nighttime right now, so we need to watch out for zombies. Get some let me go get some of these frames down and I'll go ahead and start that. I don't know why it's lagging so much. I've already loaded this area. Yeah, we shouldn't be able to get up from over there. I think the only guys that could potentially get up over there is the Spider Boy.
Oh, I can't. I guess it can't go on top of that. Oh boy, just had to be made of steel and have a thousand HP. <laughs> it's okay, it's almost done. Almost done. Yeah, and, I'm, and we have nowhere close to the amount of materials to even start the cement stuff, because we need to learn uh, rebarb frames and stuff like that. The rebarb frame is pretty much what these wood frames do, but they're made of rebarb. And what you do is you place the cement on them, and then you place wood. Let me break that too. Then you place wood on it. So it holds the shape, I guess. Or no, 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 you place the wood first around the rebarb, then you can hit it with your cement. Then it sits there, and after a while, you just come back and you can take off the wood, and you'll have hardened cement. So you can't just place concrete. You know, you have to actually let it dry and all that stuff. It's kind of cool in this game. You also have to watch out, too, because stuff will collapse if it's not supported. So I could put a door there. Let me get on top. Hopefully vultures don't come at me right now. Yeah, that's all the that's all the frames I built. Let me get these corners made. Because I'm not gonna be able to reach the corners from the inside. those. Can't reach this layer though because I need to place the roof. Man, dude, why am I, am I guys getting hungry as heck? I need to go raid some places tomorrow. My hunger keeps at it. Okay, I hear some people, there's some people downstairs getting angry. Let's go take care of them and I'm gonna go ahead and end that episode. This is day, this is day five now. Where the heck are you? There goes your leg and now your brains. Okay guys, well thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.